one of my workout outfits I just got. Oh, I'm bored, I'm bored. If you bored. Welcome back, Kyru TV fam. This is the day that the Lord himself hath made. So let us all rejoice and be glad in it. I am and you should too. Oh, it is late in the day. It's like 445. Can you believe it? Today has been one of those like lazy days for me. Like even so even though I still have stuff to do and things that I have to do, like with Shama, her homeschooling and um Sardinia's homeschooling working out and all that stuff it's still it's like i just got dressed like literally like about 30 minutes or something 30 minutes 30 months i curled my hair for the first time in a few days today actually i was trying to take this sewing out but it's not ready to come off right come up right there yes yet so i thought i was about to take this sew down out this is like a frontal closure so it's kind of it's just like glued from here to here it's not ready to come up all the way yet i thought i was gonna wash my hair or my curly hair until my new flat irons got here but no change of plans so i said let me curl it let me bring it back to life or something so i think i did good what you think what you think outfit of the day i got on okay my battery died what i was saying was i have on my one of my dresses that i got from I think I got this on TJ Maxx. It was the TJ Maxx and Marshalls try on haul that I did. If you didn't see that video, go and watch it. You have nothing but time. And I'll link you right here. Shout out to all those that have been binge watching the videos on the channel. Appreciate you so much. Because, you know, like I said, you don't just start off on a new show without actually knowing what's going on. So you got to go back. You got to go back to the beginning and catch up so you can know and you can follow along better. Instead of asking so many questions where they have already been answered, if you just go back. <laughs> right, man? Yep. And so, appreciate all those that have been binge watching the channel. Yes, I see you. I see you, girl. I see you. But if you are connected with me on Instagram or Snapchat, then you've seen this table already. But just in case you're not, I'm going to go ahead and let you see what I'm talking about. How to insert some footage a clip of the table that I showed on Instagram. This table just arrived today. Deja put it together and I don't like it. I'm going to send it back. <laughs> um, I like that this opens up and you can use it for storage, but it's wobbly as you can see. And plus this is a lighter wood. Our wood is darker. I ordered it off of Walmart online store, but it don't work. It was cute and all and the concept of it, but I want to take it back and pick up those orders. It's just some stuff for my uh, closet organization that I plan on getting done doing this. Stay at home, stay home with me. This hashtag with me, hashtag stay home with me, hashtag stay home, whatever you want to call it. COVID-19, a lot of people say quarantine, but you're only in quarantine if you have the actual virus. That's when you are quarantined. We're not quarantined. We're just under a stay-at-home order. So get it right. Get it right. Over here, I got my bandit with me. Bandit. Oh, Smokey and the bandit. You. Dark. Because of the lighting, the way it's... Hold on. Smokey and the bandit. There we go. That's a little better. <laughs> I have him covering up when he go to work. You know, it's a, sh a mad shortage, so you got to... Yeah, I'm putting on my mask, but I'm putting this something inside of it. Give me extra protection. And I found out how to make some masks out of cloth from the CDC using things that's around the house so i just need some more some more rubber bands and i'll be good you want to see a video let me know the return process is easy 
just like um it's not the same as target but target is easy too but you can do walmart in the app within the app and you just start to return and then all you do when you get there is scan the code and return got my rubber bands and my packages It's heavy. Yeah, I know. It's three boxes. I'm gonna get this closet organization um, done. I would help him, but hey, that's a man's job. <laughs> he said, dang, what is this in here? I know I have shared this on like the YouTube community. I've shared on uh, different posts. I share different posts on the YouTube community, my Instagram snapchat and stuff in the youtube community post you have to have on your um uh, at the top of your thing your your feed or your subscription page you have to have on posts plus videos or something like that about you know this time and what's going on i had did a post and i put it right here somewhere but i was saying basically how god has slowed the world down and People need to, we really need to take this time and repent first and foremost. Repent. Like, America's not going to repent, but individually we need to repent. And um, use this time wisely. Use this time to spend more time with Him, with the Holy Spirit, with God, Jesus, all one. Spend time with Him and just, you know, people say, oh, I'm bored, I'm bored. If you're bored, go get in your word if you're bored. Go and worship if you're bored. Go and praise if you're bored. You know? I'm talking about using this time wisely that we have right now because we have a lot of it. Even even though you may have stuff that you're doing within your house, the world isn't moving at the pace that it was moving in that on before. So we have a lot of time to do self-reflecting and self-examination self and to just, you know, look at our life and improving areas look at ourselves allow the lord to speak to us about where we are and things that we need to change do differently because we can't continue on the same and uh yeah we just can't and some will get it and a lot will not so hopefully you are you are one of those ones that get it and um mindful of how you're using your time because we have a lot of it and it's been slowed down for a reason for us to do all those things it, like I'm doing all of that I'm my husband's doing that soul searching and all that stuff I'm also getting things done that I should have got done a long time ago that I procrastinated with projects and you know getting more organized since that was supposed to, something I was supposed to do like what two years ago get my life more organized and put it off and put it off and put it off but during this time I am making the most of this time being more productive getting more a routine established you know with daily things making sure I exercise every day get up and get more of a routine established to where I think routine, like I've always been one of the persons that just, okay, if I feel it, then I'll do it. If I don't, if I don't feel it, then I'm not going to do it. <laughs> Every now and then, some certain things, uh, certain things you just have to do, whether you feel like it or not. But you know those things that you just like, you know you need to do it, but you put it off and you don't do it? Well, that's where organization and routines and all that kind of stuff can come into play because of it. that stuff. It, it actually helps. It's cool being in the moment and going with the flow and all that kind of stuff, but there comes a time and point in your life. If you're not getting things done that need to get done, then you need to, you know, think about or reassess how you've been doing things. Can I get an amen? Amen. Amen. <laughs> yeah, so that's what I've been doing. And uh, I'm not all the way there yet. It's coming Are together. Are we there yet? <laughs> it's coming together. And so I just, uh, and I, I constantly, every day as I get up, spend time with the Lord, praying, meditating, asking, okay, what do I need to do today? What is, what am I, um, things that I'm working on, where I'm at, just making sure I'm assessing and just getting things done. I've been knocking things out. I'm proud of myself. I've been being productive during this time. All right. Yeah. 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 Yeah
Why do you pin? <laughs> I was waiting on him to say something. I've been being productive. Miss so. productive. Yes. And hence this stuff back here. <laughs> it's a part of my productiveness during this time. But at the same time, make sure you don't want to go overboard. You know, mm -hmm. stay within your means. Mm -hmm. Don't go out and spend more, more than you have. You'd be, you know, still be budget and moderation. budget friendly and modest moderation and self control. Yes, because times are hard for a lot of people. A lot of people have lost their jobs, and you know, find things and do things that you can do that's within your house that you can do. And everything is is not all just uh, projects where you know just things like. So many things I want to get, but I just—it's not the—it's not the right time. It wouldn't be wise to go out and get those things right now. So I'm just within our means, doing things as, as I can do them. And there's a lot of free things. I'm gonna do a video about the different things you could be doing during these times to um, utilize this time and make the most of it. This time, and everybody's not everybody, but a lot of people are looking at it as a bad thing. It's not a bad thing. Not bad All thing. things work together for the good of those that love God and call according to His purpose and plan. So, there is good coming out of this. The whole thing is cool. It's not there bad. is good. That's right. There is some good things that bad are happening happens. in the midst of this bad thing because God said He'll turn all things that are meant for bad and turn to good. So, yeah, bad stuff happened before COVID 19. So. Mm -hmm. And unfortunately, there are casualties. Mm -hmm. There are people that lost their lives, and you know, with a lot of things that happen in the world, that's just always been from the beginning. And those things are going to continue to happen, and they have to happen, to, you know, for Jesus to come back, for things to prophecy and things to um, go as planned, and God as, as God has will as He has already written. It's already, already been written. We just all plan it out. Playing all our parts. Are you playing your part? Playing my part. Playing our parts. Mm -hmm. Okay. We're about to run in Publix real quick. Real quick. And then we'll see you at the house. See the house. Well, you'll see us at the house. <laughs> I got my back up right there. <laughs> quick little haul. So there's a limit on tissue. Thankfully, I found oh, something because I haven't been able to find none since I first found it when this all first started. Aluminum foil, juice pouches for the girls, or Deja, this for the girls, this strawberry woman. So Dina really likes this one. Butter. I got three packs of chicken thighs. They have a limit on these as well. And then I got some apple cinnamon oatmeal for the girls, some maple and brown sugar oatmeal. I got some eggs, cream cheese, two lime perrias. My husband got those. I got some, some more spoons and forks. Disposable plates. Four of these um, pizza lunch kits. Shama like these. She don't eat the cheese, but she eat the rest of it. Got those are three packs of this no sugar bacon, lemons, and bananas. And then I got some water for Asia. I'm gonna stockpile the water because there's a limit only, you can only get one. So I got one and my husband got one. So we're gonna have to stockpile these. And so when she does come home, there's no shortage of water to make her formula. And I got this right here. I normally get the organic one, but I got this one. I didn't see that. Yes, I did. I did see it. I'm trying to remember why I didn't get that one instead of this one. I don't know. And then I got some more blonde roast coffee for Kiki and Doobie. Only way I can drink it is if it's cold. No, it's not yours. I brought you yours when I brought it the first time again. And we brought you another one when Doobie drunk all your first one. That's mine right there. And I brought another one for the both of y'all. So, but yeah, I was saying that I've been drinking this with my almond calif califia. It tastes better when it's cold. Creamer, but I like it cold. I do not like hot coffee at all. So, Chick-fil-A kind of got me onto the iced coffee. So, I can do that and I'll just stick with my teas hot. So, iced coffee I do every now and then. Oh, and I got this right here. This casserole pans with lid. They're by iChef and they're very thick and sturdy so it comes with two of them 
and two legs. They were like six dollars. I'm gonna show you these shoes. I think I showed them on Insta stories over the weekend. But I didn't show it to you so you miss out when you don't follow on Instagram and all other social media. So cute. I know. Cause they're handmade like the glue. That's one of the downfalls about this shoe is that they are handmade and you can smell the glue. Smells loud. I really like these, but I can't fit them. Girl, they can't see the back of my hair. This is size uh, eight and a half US. That's what it says, and a thirty-nine. I, I can't fit them because they don't come in half. I don't think their sizing comes in half size. It says thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty, like that. But it says this, this is a eight and a half for US size thirty-nine. I, I normally wear eight and a half, and this is an eight and a half, and I cannot fit it. They're very tight. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. Oh, you got to see. Wait, 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 wait. Hold up. You got to see them on the foot. Like. They are so cute. Kiki been like Kiki gonna order her pair next week. She's gonna order her pair, but oh my goodness! And then it has Velcro, right? But they will look so good with some. You gotta have some anklets on. Some anklets on when you wear these, because that's what's gonna just give it that. Mm. Take it to the next level. But yeah. I can say this, this one is a size 40. It's weird, this one says size 40, but it says it's a, it's a US size um, eight. My toe is like right here, so I'm not gonna send these back. I could have used the extra half size, but I'm good. I know, the 39 is lower than the 40, and the 40 is a smaller size than the 39, so. I don't know. Did get the other curtain. It came in yesterday. They come with two in the pack, but we only have three up here. We had this one, this one, and this one, which it fits the whole uh, window. There's a fourth one that I have. It's the spare one, and I'll just keep it, and maybe I'll buy another pack so I can take those three and hang it on um, the um, window in our bedroom. It looks so much better in here with the curtains. Like when we come out here in the mornings and stuff like that, we'd be like, wait, it looks different up in here. I'm like, girl, what have you been waiting on? But only thing with this is you just have to really like close in the gaps. Really good. I messed it up. But I had it right last night. I was telling Deja we should have just went ahead and put the fourth one up there. I probably will still later. But for now, like it's on this side, it's gap. <laughs> yes, it is. There. No, no. You have to say, I'm not ready yet. Okay, there you go. It's filled in now. <laughs> and these chairs, in case you don't know, these chairs I got like a uh, few years ago. These were in our bedroom. And I brought them out here. This does not belong out here. This is actually Deja's. This little um thing. Yeah, she wants a bean bag to go in here, so she used that out here until we get one that goes with the decor. This is how my dress is, and this I can wear it like. And the dress I can wear it like this, off the shoulder, or I can wear it like a man. I just feel like my dad is the Oh, I like long and boy dresses. But this is one of my workout outfits I just got. Of course, you know, I like the colors. Don't have to look at your hair. The pockets right here. So if you're out working out, you're running, walking, you put your phone right there. I want to get a large in the tops just to have more room. Cover that up. More to go. 
just get that off. That's apple seven keys. Woo. What's for dinner? We had fajitas last night, so I just mixed the um, peppers and onions together into the chicken that we had left over. Kiki had chipotle, and Shama had one of her lunch kits, and Sadina already ate two. Okay, I am coming back to end this vlog. I am currently editing this video right now. I'm trying to get it up by tomorrow morning, which is Wednesday the 9th. We'll see. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, thumbs it up, share. Don't be shy, say hi. Subscribe if you haven't already. Click the bell to get notifications so you won't miss any videos. Check back to the channel frequently. Until next time, Lord say the same. Keep it real and you will see me in the next one.